Welcome back. We are dialing out to the 814 to find out what makes you mad. So, Rebecca, this was trending on Twitter with a phrase that's not appropriate for TV, <laughs> but it was trending on Twitter. What really makes you mad? A lot of people think it's got some things about driving, things like that. Yeah. Except you were telling me in the office some really weird things that made you mad. I only had two things. They were strange. I said, one, that they're not teaching cursive in schools anymore. <laughs> like that, that that's what gets you really angry. I want children to be able to read the Constitution. <laughs> <laughs> and the Declaration of Independence. Uh, is that an issue? There's version. There's, there's I the think people, now. Imagine one day you'll have people and no one will know how to read cursive. You Good. Will be, you'll that look was the at worst it. part of the SAT. Okay, fine. I and, had no idea what I was doing. And secondly, what really grinds my gears, I know, I don't know why, but when I go out to eat and I see a couple that's on a date or something, <laughs> And they're just both with their nose in their phones. But that has, that has nothing to do with you. Yeah, but <laughs> I your, just... <laughs> your experience and your fun is making me mad. I want them to be interacting, Jordan. I don't... I guess sometimes I feel like, okay, you're going out for a reason. <laughs> you could sit at I, home on your phone. I want you to be interacting for me <laughs> and my benefit. I want to know your relationship Hey, is I great. care a lot about this type okay. of communication. Fair enough. What grinds your gears? <sighs> hmm. I don't like, and, and this is one of the ones that actually somebody sent in, when people tailgate on you, when you're oh, like okay. driving the speed yeah. limit, that gets me mad. It's like, what do, what do you want me to do? Yeah. You want me to get pulled over? Yeah, you don't, don't seem like fired. you get too grumpy. No, not really. Just it's when good. I'm hungry. Oh. I get hangry. I, I sit that. next to him, people. <laughs> right after lunch is the time you want to talk to Jordan. He's <laughs> <laughs> it's a lot better. It's a lot That's better. That's normally when I ask for favors. Okay, let's go <laughs> and dial 814. Let's see what some of the comments that you sent in. This first one is from Lenene. She says, when someone is chewing or crunching food right next to me, it drives me insane, especially chips. I agree with that. I'm I absolutely sorry. agree with that. What'd you say? Oh my goodness, Rebecca. <laughs> You're just, <laughs> you just, neck, 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 neck. just turned the channel off. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay. Okay, Sue W says, when I open the freezer and there's no ice cream. That would make me upset. There could, has to be ice cream in there. Every single day. I now, get upset. Holly E said, she wouldn't say it makes her mad, but she finds the whole pumpkin spice thing annoying. I don't like everyone rushing to seasons and stores put out the next big holiday the day after. Very irritating. That's I think true. it's when it's too early, is what she's saying. Yeah. Like right now is the perfect time for it, but like when it's like April, I don't want to see pumpkin spice. I'm trying to, to think Christmas of some weird pumpkin spice things I've seen that you're like, no, they shouldn't go together. That's weird. Like Tide Pods or something. <laughs> I don't know why you would need that. <laughs> okay, Mary B, she said, when you're driving the speed limit, yep. that's what you said, Jordan, you're and right, people Mary. are right on your bumper trying to pass you. Mary, you and I are basically in the same car yelling at the same person. That's Always peace. happens. Always happens. And then Holly M, we had a lot of Hollies today, says just people in general. <laughs> People in general, <laughs> people in general just make her mad. Oh. <laughs> That's what I gets her so angry. Um, we need some more optimism, Holly. Yeah, right? More optimism, girl. Obviously. People aren't that bad. <laughs> we just got to watch our good news segments, and we'll find yes. some good people out there. Yes, and actually, our good news segments for today are amazing. Yeah, great people. You know who else is amazing? Mm, Mike Doyle. Our meteorologist, <laughs> Mike Doyle. There he is. Hey, buddy.